Hello friends, we are Rituban and Arunima, the Diversity Travellers. We live in Hobart, capital of the beautiful Australian state Tasmania. Experiencing the diversity of this wonderful world through travel is our passion. Over the last 15 years, during our time in England and Australia, we have travelled to six continents, 40 countries and over 50 great cities and extraordinary natural wonders. We are creating short videos based on our own recordings to archive our beautiful memories and share with you on our YouTube channel. Visiting Hobart's waterfront and walking along the shore is a beautiful thing and you can't miss the iconic red boat park there called Spirit of Hobart. On a very sunny and calm day, we jumped on the Spirit of Hobart for a Hobart's historic launch cruise. One and a half hour cruise will take you for a nice little ride, sailing past different suburbs of Hobart, crossing the Race Point Casino, then returning along the eastern shoreline, passing by Rosny and other suburbs before sailing under the Tasman Bridge. The first European settlement began in 1803 as a military camp at Risdon Cove on the eastern shores of the River Derwent. The River Derwent was one of the Australia's finest deep water ports and was the centre of South Sea whaling and sealing trades. The settlement rapidly grew into a major port with allied industries such as shipbuilding, soon became Hobart Town named after Lord Hobart. Hobart Town became a city on 21st August of 1842 and was renamed Hobart from the beginning of 1881. Battery Point suburb is generally known as one of the city's most prestigious suburbs with many large and extravagant homes and apartment blocks. Battery Point is named after the battery of guns which were established on this point in 1818 as part of the Hobart's coastal defence. The battery was situated on the site of today's Princess Park. Mount Wellington lies directly behind Hobart and is the city's dominating feature in the skyline. It is 1270 meter high and was formed during the Jurassic ages. There is a little 90 minute bus tour that you can take from the Hobart waterfront, which will take you to the summit of Mount Wellington. Views of Hobart from the top is just breathtaking. Sandy Bay is a suburb located immediately south of the suburb of Battery Point. The suburb has several beaches along the shore, many large homes and is also known as one of the city's prestigious areas. University of Tasmania is also located in this Sandy Bay suburb. 
Australia's first legal casino, Rest Point Casino, opened in 1973, is also located in the Sandy Bay suburb. view of Hobart from the River Derwent was spectacular. At some point, we couldn't even distinguish the boundary between the blue sky and the blue water. We also had a nice lunch on board. On our way towards the northern cruise route, we sail past Rosny and other suburbs before sailing under the Tasman Bridge. In January 1975, the bulk carrier Lake Illawarra, traveling up the Darwent River, collided with several pylons of the Tasman Bridge and caused a large section of the bridge deck to collapse onto the ship and eventually into the river below. Twelve people were killed, including seven crew on board. Hobart was cut off from the eastern suburbs and loss of the road connection had a major social impact. As part of our cruise, we cruised under the Tasman Bridge. It was a slow and smooth sail, obviously no disaster today, only sailing past the tragic history that happened in this very spot 47 years ago. Hope you enjoyed the nice little cruise with us today. Visit Hobart and visit Tasmania. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more regular video uploads. Share with your friends and families and enjoy the world's amazing diversity. Thanks for watching our travel videos.